National research study is hoping to better understand the long term impact of COVID-19 in children and adults. This study also hopes to look into who is most at risk of experiencing persistent symptoms. CBS 8's Rocia De La Fe joins us now with more on the study. Yeah, that's right. This is being called the first of its kind study across the country, and it's hoping to answer questions researchers have been asking since the onset of COVID-19. CDC recommendation is for the arm. UC San Diego and Rady Children's Hospital are joining a nationwide effort aimed at better understanding COVID-19 and its long-term impact on health. The $1.15 billion four-year study is called Researching COVID to Enhance Recovery Initiative, and it's sponsored by the National Institutes of Health. The study will look into long-term COVID symptoms in children and adults that can last for weeks, if not months, after being infected. Researchers will try to determine who's most at risk. So this is actually the first of its kind across the country. Dr. Kay Ree at UC San Diego School of Medicine says there's not much known about long COVID, which is why there's a push to kickstart the study. I'm hoping that this study, this effort, will really try to help um, illuminate some of those answers for us. Dr. Ree says symptoms of long COVID in children include headaches, fatigue, chronic cough, and even the loss of taste and smell, among others. This is affecting kids and adults alike, and we just really don't know much about it. Who's at risk and why do some kids get it and some kids don't? 20,000 children and their parents will participate in the study nationally. Researchers here locally are looking to recruit about 600 to 700 families to participate. So we're going to potentially have a lot of um, impact in trying to understand, you know, what's happening with these kids? Why are these kids getting long COVID and what does it look like? Locally, the study will evaluate how often these cases happen within our community and its risk factors in newborns, children, and young adults. Researchers say their goal is to better understand the disease so they can develop better and more efficient treatments and prevention strategies for those at risk. And if you're interested in joining this research study, we've posted a link on our website with everything that you need to know to sign up. Just go to CBS8.com.